Now, uh, speaking of the Von Erics, they had really kind of peaked, as, as we mentioned before, with the Freebirds. But, man, they are crazy over with the local crowd here still. Uh, coming in the door, would you say that you were excited about the opportunity with, to work with, you know, the biggest stars in the territory? I was I was excited, but I was also uh, guarded, mm -hmm. you know, because I, I knew that it wasn't as easy as, as you thought it would be. Right. It should have been simple. It should have been very simple, mm -hmm. but because of the uh, because of their temperament and because of the way they deal with, dealt with business, it, it wasn't so easy. So I've heard about the way that they dealt with business. And, you know, obviously anybody listening to this probably knows that they they had substance abuse issues and they were irresponsible. They wouldn't always show up to the building when they were supposed to. And that's that's a big deal in this era because these crowds are coming out specifically to see these boys and then they just don't show up after being advertised. Absolutely. But but when you talk about their personalities, Jake, uh, were they good people or like how how did they treat you? They were like little kids, man. Okay. They were like, they were like 15 year olds. Oh man. You know, they didn't have, they didn't understand responsibility. They didn't understand anything. They were just, they were young, very young and they've been pushed into this position and uh, the demands were huge, huge. They didn't want the responsibility. None of them did. But they did want the money which is uh, what we're going to be talking about here in just a minute. Uh, so, Jake, up to this point, I mean, you're at the top of your game, and that's obvious to anybody watching. You know, they kept referencing throughout the, uh, the, the videos that I would see, like, God, look at how fast this guy is. And you were. You were lightning fast with your jabs and kind of the way that you got around the ring. Um, so you were at the top of your game, and you had worked with some of the best wrestlers in the world up to this point. Uh, uh, how did you assess the Von Eric boys as wrestlers when they were uh, when they had their heads screwed on straight? Well, I'm still waiting. <laughs> okay, so you never got to work with clean and sober Von Eric boys. Well, I did. Wow, that is that is very telling for our listening audience. Like you were there from August to January, worked with them a lot, and you never yeah. got them straight. I never got them straight, brother. Wow. Okay, so I mean, it's it's taken the first night there or your first night working with them, you realize that they have a problem with substance abuse and no shows. Yeah, absolutely, dude, brutal, 